Good morning, beautiful people. Good morning, my YouTube family. It is 9.30 now in Mexico City. It is muy frío. <laughs> But we, I'm about to go on a tour to the pyramids. I'm about to go on the tour bus right now. And then it's going to take us there. The tour is supposed to be for 9 hours. So I'm going to be on the road for 9 hours the entire day. I'm very excited. I've always wanted to see the pyramids in Mexico, in Latin America. So I am anticipating what is to come. <laughs> Culturas. The purpose of this site here, it's, it's pretty much saying that there are three cultures and three cultures in a sense where the Spaniards, the, the native people that were here before the Spaniards came and modern Mexico. The rocks there are from the ancient history and then the church is from the Spaniards because when the Spaniards came they demolished a few of the buildings that the native people created and they decided to build a cathedral or churches everywhere they go so when you when you come to mexico city you'll notice that there is a there is a cathedral or a church everywhere like every turn you made you see a church and the aim of that was for them to have as much church as possible so they can convert the Indians into Christians and all Catholic so hence the reason for them having so many churches there were some sites that they could not they, they could not destroy and therefore they built a church exactly beside it so that's the whole point of that's the whole reason behind a church being near to the historical site here Decide not to cut the heart. The plant suffers a process similar to the aloe vera. The heart in the middle grows, blooms, and the plant dies. Like beer, 5%. Mm. And the name of this wine is pulque. Pulque. In case you wish to see it in some minutes, I will give you a sample of pulque so you can know about the drink which is 600 years of history. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, in Mexico City, you can still find some places we call pulquerias. What they, what they sell there, only pulque. <laughs> and you can see on weekend, Mexican people there drinking four liters or five of this juice every day. Wow. As some German people drink beer, so <laughs> this can do with pulque. <laughs> <laughs> also, sometimes it ferments a little bit more. In that case, we like to mix it with fruits as a milky shake. Mm -hmm. So you can find strawberry, coconut, mango, mm -hmm. banana, and some other flavors of pulque in that place. Now, see the look of the heart. Our people discover some other important uses. And you can see off each leaf, we get points like this. They don't look so dangerous. For see how the point, can go through the leaf. Ooh. If you fit the, the leaf thicker than our skin. Oh my God. In ancient times, used for fishing or hunting. Yeah. They were also good to make piercings, tattoos and offerings. This point different numeral cause no infection. And you know when historians in Mexico talk about offerings, you have to imagine Aztec young warrior, 12, 13 years, using points like this every day to pick arms and legs, mm. to offer the blood to the gods. Mm. Of the links, mm. give me your hands, Gilitas. And this is the silver comb. So to make necklaces or bracelets, the designer must join the links one by one to the silver comb, thinking in, in, uh, taking in care of the design she wants to produce. In this case, this is how they give the necklace or the bracelets a special flexibility. Hold the cigarettes. 
and imagine how many links they have joined together to make a necklace of that quality. A lot. <laughs> when wow. this is finished, as you appreciate, it has a special flexibility. Yeah, wow. Well, see the this is lava? Si, si, vida. Well, see the color we have in our country. I have lava in my hands. <laughs> si, si, vida. Well, you know, obsidian is found also in many countries around the world. Right. Chile, Guatemala, Peru, Ecuador, Costa Rica, New Zealand, Hawaii, Japan, France, Italy, Spain. <laughs> but always black. The color I show you now is of the unique of this city. No other place of the world to get such quality stone. This is oxide. another one too. Sicilita. This has iron oxide. And there is a silvery quality that has aluminum. Oh. This material is a stone you see by lots in that museum of anthropology. Oh, yeah. Used to make weapons and tools. Mm. Arrowheads, knives, axes, spears. After we cut off a block of stone, we start carving it using machines with diamond blades. So in the first step of the process, you will see we have produced only general details. After that, we use tools as small as the ones that we use for our teeth. To detail the face and the headdress. After some days work, you can see the details are almost finished. And this is the most important symbol of our civilization. And this is made out of the, the stone? Si, si, vida. Wow. This is the sun god. His name is Tonatiu. Tonatiu. And after tequila I expect you can learn easier as take words. Okay. This is not finished yet. We have to polish again. Oh. But in order to see the color, we can get the stone wet. She can see the real color of the carving is the golden stone. Wow. Sun god already polished. So this is a beautiful carving that oh, took us three weeks nice. work. Many people think this is lacquer, no lacquer, only polish, polish, polish. Uh -huh. And the reason I like to show you the material, you can see this is real, this is natural. The point, be careful with the guys around the pyramids. Oh. Because many of them offer you pieces that look like ours, but they are not the same. They're, so they're selling stones? Uh, no, Sita, they offer you uh, masks which are plastic oh, painted. Oh, okay. That's why uh, Alexander has told you for our real work here, we have to offer you certificate of authenticity. Oh. To make sure, Matthias Arria, to make sure handmade. Mm. Not for the massage stone, not for the mirrors, not for the pyramids. These are the the different um, cactus? Oh, uh, well, this is a succulent. This is the blue agave to produce tequila. This is the one used to produce te tequila? Si, si, Wow. But this is only two years old. You know, to produce tequila, they are about six years old. So six years old. What grows most on these plants is the heart. Mm. The heart is on the ground. Mm. Uh, they say that to produce tequila, the heart must weigh about 20 kilograms. Oh, wow. If not, they better let the plant there. Mm -hmm. uh, but I know this plant. And the I process think. of tequila is different. They cut off all of the leaves. They only oh. get the heart. Mm -hmm. That heart is cooked into ovens mm -hmm. to get sugar. Because remember, no sugar, no alcohol. Mm -hmm. okay. There is another plant we call agave spadin mm -hmm. to produce mezcal with the worm. That agave spadin is over there. You can see same family, different shape. This one. Si, si, ah, yeah. But you know, to cook the heart of that, these guys use wood. Mm -hmm. That's why mezcal has always a smoky flavor. Uh -huh. After they have put the heart, they have to smash to let it ferment. After 30 days of fermentation begins the process of distillation. That's the reason always the first drink will be white. Oh. The steel and bottled immediately. The color is obtained in oak barrels where it is aged in. After that you can find young tequila which is only three months old. These two steps of tequila are not good at all. When they age the tequila for one year, this is now good quality. Then in the bottle you can find written tequila reposado. Reposado means aged. Mm -hmm. And there is one which is the best. Mm -hmm. Tequila añejo two years old. But I don't recommend you añejo instead of the reposado. Mm -hmm. Because tequila añejo is 42% alcohol, reposado is 35. Oh. So the best will be the strongest. Yeah. And this is a lot better señoritas. But aloe vera is not a cactus, that's not, not an agave plant. That is another family. That another is family. Lilacia. Lila, Lilacias are garlics and onions. 
See, different of the cactus. Yeah. And as I told you, you can find cactus as small as those there. Mm. But these are feral cactus, those are agave plants. So as I told you, each in the cactus we have, we have different families. Mm -hmm. Many people from Europe ask about peyote. Mm. That peyote uh, causes hallucinations. Oh. That will be similar to this boat without spines. And now peyote is in that year of extinction. Because oh. imagine this kind of cactus delay one year to grow only one centimeter. Oh. Oh, so peyote is only eight centimeters tall. Oh, that is never okay. a huge plant. Yeah, so yeah. The, this is a big, this is a big one? Um, uh, well, these are the about old uh, one. maybe 10 years, senorita. 10 years? 10 years, yes. And this is the one that causes hallucinations? And this, no. No. Peyote, no yes. <laughs> so that's about uh, 20 years. This is 20 <laughs> years? Si, <laughs> senorita. <laughs> about. Wow. That's crazy. Si, <laughs> senorita. It is the tour. Guys, I'm trying tequila. <laughs> this is the wine. To try the wine, you have to say after me. Arriba, 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 abajo, abajo okay. al centro, al centro, adentro. Si te cheers, fue una de las cheers de México. Salud. 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 Oh. Oh. That, that's not yeah. bad. Yeah, this is really good. Uh, this is uh, soft. Yeah. Oh. Right. Not strong. It tastes. In Australia, we have um, something called Vegemite. It's like, a, it's like a spread you put on bread. It tastes a little bit like that. <laughs> well, it, it tastes like that because uh, the it's people say this easy. is like this. Yes, yes, that's exactly, exactly what it's like. Yeah. Uh, this is pulque. This is pulque. 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 Oh, this is a tequila. This is not strong tequila. This is smooth because this is an artisanal tequila. People from Jalisco send only for us. And the real next way is this. We don't need the hand. We put salt direct on the line. Ah. And you can see that Mexican used to do this with many kind of drinks and also many kind of food. Squeeze it into your mouth, hold the juice, drink tequila, mix it together as a cocktail. Cheers. Squeeze it, hold the juice, drink and mix. In this way, tequila is not strong. <laughs> Reposado. That's the important word about Kila. Mexico is the same name, Saltillo Coahuila in North Mexico. But you know, as I told you, what changes on them is the color. They're yellow, they're red. But you know, this work is something you can find wherever you go in our country. The reason is uh, because this is simple in the signs. Only lines, only stripes. To make this, guys used to uh, use to work looms with only two pedals. But you know, in this area we work with a loom that has four pedals, which is different. This is what you use? This is the home, look. Wow. Look, with feet, the specialist loop comes up and down. Yeah. Yeah. So this is how they move the pedals to make such design. Colors appear into the shuttle. Oh. The specialist places the shuttle here. When fire opens, it goes forward, it goes back. Making one thread by one, the cloth and the combination of the colors. Right. But here, something I like to show you very much is the resistance. When, uh, when the shuttle goes forward and back, they use the left hand to tighten. Oh. In this case, he tightens very special to make something which is really strong and very special in resistance. Look, try to put this here, everywhere you want, no problems. Oh, wow. We can also, Signitas, even do this. Yeah. Wow. But I don't recommend you to do this with that. Yeah. Signitas, look. Oh. Oh. The reason the people that used to make this, this is not produced here, this is produced here. The people that used to make this, 
want to save some money in material. Oh. So when they tighten, they tighten but only to join the thread. Mm. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Here, no matter the, the, the material they use, what we want to produce is something which is high quality work. Mm. Right, right. And also, similitas of these textiles of both, you can find imitations around the pyramids. You have to be careful. Okay. And of this, uh, there is also, of course, as I tell you, also these colors will be the same. Mm -hmm. We'll see the difference. As you appreciate, right, right, the right. main cloth was orange. Now the main cloth is turquoise. This is one. Oh, nice. Huh? Red, blue, yellow. Yeah. So yeah. I mean here, colors always will be different. <laughs> Can you hold this? Of course, Sirita. <laughs> Una bella modelo. <laughs> I'm going to head to the pyramids to see the pyramid of the sun god and the other things that they have in store for us. Right now I'm looking to buy a fridge magnet for my collection. I was just tasting Mexican candies and I just ate an insect. I don't know what it is. They have some Spanish name for it, but in Jamaican language, in English, I'm pretty sure say, I've eaten something that is not normal <laughs> and I'm not supposed to eat. <laughs> but I just ate an insect, I don't know what it is. It has like um, a savory, spicy taste, but you have a weird aftertaste. I guess that comes with travel, huh? Trying new things, trying weird new things. So I'm waiting on the other guys to come back to the bus so we can head to the pyramids. And we're going to the Pyramides de Teochihuacan. 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 Yo, there's no makeup because that really not. And then we get to lunch. Yep. That's it. Next.